In this video, I provide the solution to question number nine for practice exam number three for Math 1050. We have to solve the polynomial inequality x minus one squared times x plus four is greater than zero. Uh, so if we think of the left-hand side as the function f of x right here, we're essentially trying to graph this thing. Graphing is really the best way to solve these inequalities here. And so let's just sketch a graph of this thing really quickly. Uh, because the left-hand side is already factored, we can see the x-intercepts. These are the markers for our inequality here. We're going to have x as 1 comes from the first one, and then we have negative 4 from the second one. Looking at the multiplicities, x minus 1 has, uh, that is x minus 1 has a even multiplicity, so we're going to touch the x-axis right there. Uh, x plus 4 has an odd multiplicity, so we're going to cross the x-axis there. This function is approximately equal to x cubed as x goes to plus or minus infinity. So the in behavior would point up on the right hand side and points down on the left hand side. And so putting this information together, we have to get a picture that looks something like this. Okay, so now the thing we're looking for is what happens above the, y, the x axis, right? So we want f of x to be greater than zero. That means we're looking for things above the x axis. Uh, so that happens here from negative four to one, and it also happens from one to infinity. Um, f of x is not greater than negative, or it's not greater than zero at negative four or at one, uh, because at those x-intercepts, it's f of x is equal to zero. So we see that the correct answer is going to be negative four to one, union one to infinity. So the correct answer is C.